looking at an object so dark that your brain cannot process its shape. It looks like a hole in reality, as if light itself is missing. This is what happens with materials like Vanta Black, which was once considered the darkest substance on Earth. But scientists at MIT have now created something even darker. This new material absorbs 99.995% of all light, making it 10 times darker than Vanta Black. It is so dark that a diamond coated in it completely disappeared to the naked eye. But how is this possible and why does this matter? Let's explore the science behind these ultra black materials, how they work and why they are so important. What is Vanta Black? Vanta Black was developed in 2014 by a British company called Surrey Nanosystems. It is made of carbon nanotubes, CNTs, which are microscopic tubes of carbon arranged in a way that traps light inside. To understand how it works, imagine a dense forest with tall trees. When light enters, instead of bouncing back, it gets trapped between the trees. The same principle applies to Vanta Black. Light enters the nanotube structure and gets absorbed, making the surface appear completely black. It absorbs 99.965% of visible light, making objects appear two-dimensional as if all depth is removed. It has been used in space telescopes, military applications and even art installations. However, applying Vanta Black requires special vacuum conditions making it difficult to use on a large scale. How MIT created an even darker material? In 2019, MIT scientists accidentally created an even darker material while working on new techniques for electrical conductivity. They grew carbon nanotubes on an etched aluminum surface which unexpectedly created a material that absorbed 99.995% of light, the highest ever recorded. What makes it darker than Vanta Black? Denser nanotube structure. More light gets trapped with no chance of escaping. Aluminum etching process. The material surface eliminates reflection further improving absorption. To prove its effectiveness, the MIT team used it in an art exhibit called The Redemption of Vanity, where they coated a $2 million diamond with this material. The result? The diamond became invisible to the human eye. Vanta Black and MIT's Ultra Black material share the same core technology, carbon nanotubes. But MIT's version takes darkness to a whole new level. While Vanna Black absorbs 99.965% of light, MIT's Ultra Black material absorbs 99.995%, making it significantly darker. The difference may seem small, but visually it creates an even deeper void where objects lose all sense of shape and texture. One key distinction is how they are made. Vanta Black is applied using a complex vacuum deposition process which limits where and how it can be used. MIT's material, on the other hand, is grown on etched aluminum, making it more adaptable to different surfaces. This means it has broader applications in areas like space technology, photography and thermal management, where controlling light absorption is crucial. While both materials are revolutionizing optics and engineering, MIT's ultra black material stands out because it is darker, more efficient and easier to work with, making it a significant advancement over Vanta Black. Real world applications Ultra black materials have several cutting edge applications. Space exploration. NASA can use this material to coat telescope components, reducing glare and improving deep space imaging. Photography and optics. Cameras can use ultra black coatings to eliminate reflections and lens flare, improving image quality. Thermal management. This material can absorb heat efficiently, 
making it useful for spacecraft, solar panels and other energy applications. From art and technology to space exploration, ultra-black materials are changing the way we control light. MIT's new material is darker than Vanta Black and has the potential for even broader applications. What would you do with this material if you had access to it? Let us know in the comments. If you found this interesting, make sure to like, share and subscribe for more science and technology insights. Stay curious and see you in the next video.